Some people think that poetry should be written only about beautiful things. But no, it's written about life. This is on page 91. It's called City Nights. My windows and doors are barred against the intrusion of thieves. There is nothing you can tell me about the city I do not know. On the front porch, it is cool and quiet after the high-pitched panic passes. The windows across the street gleam in the dark. I started writing as a child. My first poem was published when I was 12 years old and my first book was published when I was 17, just a few days after I graduated from high school. I have spent a lot of my life uh, publishing the work of other poets. Altogether, it's over 90 books of poetry by individuals that I have published. I think one of the most important books we have ever published was an anthology called Adam of Ife, Black Women in Praise of Black Men. And uh, it's a book that needed to be done. She has pursued a life of prolific creativity, supported other writers and poets, reached across generations to spark in young people a love of words and writing, and maintained a deep and abiding commitment to metropolitan Detroit. It's my deep pleasure and honor to ask all of you to raise your glasses here, here, and toast here. our 2012 eminent artist, Naomi Long Madgett. Being a poet and being a teacher has helped me to be a better editor. Everything that I have done has, has worked together. By publishing, so many good poets. I see myself as the first rung of a ladder, and I'm happy to see those poets climb up to better things. The front porch is cool and quiet. The neighbors are dark and warm. The grandchildren are upstairs dreaming, and we are happy for their presence. <laughs>